my name is Kiki Stella Krim and I welcome you back on the last Monday of 2018, the last day with an incredible, incredible energy. Yes, for everybody who doesn't know me, I'm Kiki Stella Krim. I'm a numerologist and a feng shui, an expert in feng shui and an astrologer. Yes, and well, I I also do creative writing and I have an app there. Well, you can find that in my in my bio. But let me talk now a little bit about what is so exciting about this idea. Today's numerological vibration is a nine. And when we talk about a nine, a nine appears in feng shui, a nine appears in numerology, and uh, it is an important number indeed. And it is considered to be the number of uh, completion, the number of closure. And today, especially today, I would say it is a happy nine. Isn't this wonderful news on the last day of 2018? So what can we do is this what would be my special tip first of all I would say you should really do a little review grab your coffee and take a moment uh, if you can take a paper I have a paper here and take a marker or a pen avoid to take a pencil because I don't want you to erase I really want you to see clearly what is coming uh, through the handwriting on this sheet of paper and uh, this could be everything from pain to burden. Um, happy moments, leave them for another occasion. Today I want you to write only down what has been toxic uh, from relationships, circumstances, situation and you have still not processed. So this is the opportunity to get rid of it. Okay, so if you choose the option number one, which could be writing on a sheet of paper, then you fold this paper, you make it like a little small um, envelope and uh, any candle you have, maybe you still have the candles from Christmas dinner, well use one of these candles and burn this because fire is such an important element to close chapters to turn pages and uh, to get rid of all the burden of pain. The second option I have under the numerological vibration of the nine is to do this uh, imaginary, okay? If you are not into handwriting and you don't have time today, what you can do is in a quiet moment, you visualize a beautiful, beautiful suitcase and that you put everything that you don't need down want anymore in the 2009 19 you put that in the suitcase then you close the suitcase okay and you send it to the universe so easy two perfect options for today because there's all the helping energy from the universe to make this happen, okay? So, what else do we have? Later the day, we will have the action-orientated planet Mars uh, being really active. The planet Mars will be switching signs and will be traveling until February 14th in the fire sign Aries. And that makes him very happy. This planet will be very, very happy because that is his house. And uh, for Aries, this is especially very good news because this is the opportunity to really push forward in progress. So Aries is a quite impulsive sign. So I would say, uh, take it easy, okay? It is perfect that you get this chance. So, and under today's numerology and being the last day of the year 2018 and with this news so you have like an extra ticket an extra bonus for the beginning of 2019 and you really should take the opportunity this is especially for Aries but also for the other two fire signs for Leo and for Sagittarius and the other nine zodiac signs will also be able to have positive effects okay but as this is exactly happening in areas and in the group of the fire signs the 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 strongest impact will of course being on areas and um, well then we have tomorrow the first day of 2019 
if uh, we have a little look on what is going on with the numbers from 2019 if we add them up we get a 12 and the 12 finally is a 3 so the universal number in the new universal numerology vibration of 2019 is a 3 yes and that talks about communication on one side all aspects everything that includes communication but it also talks about creativity and if you have not found your way how to channel stress how to channel uh, emotional up and downs it could be your invitation to really find a way to channel this uh, with any artistic activity okay and artistic activity this is such a wide subject because it, it starts with cooking with baking uh, with painting singing dancing knitting crocheting sewing okay so there's so much you can do and I'm sure there is something for everybody of us and uh, talking about the communication aspects well Communication is listening and um, talking, expressing, writing, okay, and uh, probably, and that is always depending on your personal numerology, of course, you need like to polish, to fine tune certain aspects in communication. Okay, so uh, this is very, very interesting. And then considering the numerology of the first day of the year, which is January 1st, 2019, we will have a numerological vibration of a five. But there's something that's popping out when I see that number combination for tomorrow. And there's a very, very strong number one. Okay, so, be careful, uh, watch your words, don't be too impulsive in, in restructuring. Everything needs to be really good, uh, analyzed and you should have all the background information to trace your strategy, to trace your plan, okay? It will be certainly a very, very active Tuesday. Don't be surprised if all of a sudden family shows up, you didn't expect them, you're still in PJs, but they want to be there with you there will be a lot of talk a lot of laughter it's a beautiful number but remember when we are all together with friends or whoever is family on the first day of the new year there is a lot of tension also and we are already accumulating energy because we are heading to the first solar eclipse the first new moon of the year so uh, this is uh, the moment where sometimes certain conversational topics could be like very delicate you should consider this okay religion politics and probably uh, the new boyfriend from from the daughter or something like this okay yeah, maybe you should keep this for another occasion that is everything I have for you for now and I take the opportunity to express my um, thank you to you, to each of you, each single one of you has taken the time to read my updates, my daily posts, my blog, yes, to join me in Instagram, to follow me, to spread the word and to praise this. I'm very honored and um, appreciate this from the bottom of my heart and I'm looking forward to entertain you in 2019 with more tips and fresh updates and so far I hope you come you get safe to the new year if you are drinking well order the uber early enough leave the car at home or go back walking if you can reach it in walking distance and i see you in 2019 happy new year Ch -ch 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 -ch.